Here's the Rycote Envision Stereo Pair Kit. It pairs two of these INV-7HG MK3 shock mounts together. And I already opened it. Here's what it looks like. This is all you get in the kit. On the bottom here, there's a thread mount right in the middle. And then you have an adapter so you can put into a regular mic stand or other stands mounts. Very versatile. It's not quarter 20, it's 3 8 for this adapter. And then you have your two shock mounts. The reason why this interested me, uh, there, there's two reasons um, that I got this. The first reason, and my primary reason, is that I was looking for an extra shock mount for my uh, Rode NTG3 and my Sennheiser MK what is it? My Sennheiser MKH416. And this is supposed to fit the bill. I'll bring those uh, those mics out and, and insert them so you see what it looks like on here. But um, So I was in the market for, for just one of these shock mounts. And uh, I, I was looking at just one of these and it's about, oh, $60, $65, maybe even $70 depending on where you look for just one of these. And then I saw this which to me, unless someone can correct me here, they're the exact same and it's about $120, but I found this used for $100. So for $100 used, I was able to get two of these shock mounts that normally go for like $65 plus this bar and I can use it for the second reason why I was curious about this is I'm getting into podcasts and interviews, sit down interviews where you're at a table and then one, the host is on one side and the guest is on the other side. And normally you would have a studio boom arm that you would see on Howard Stern, standard radio host type of arms and a lot of podcasters are using those. But I haven't seen podcasters use shotgun mics for their podcasts. Uh, you, I, you, they totally work if you can use them. Uh, in, a, in the right way. So I figured that if I had this set up, I can get some kind of a table tripod, put this right here, stick one mic, point one mic towards the host and one mic towards the guest so they're facing opposite of each other and I could get really good audio with this unique setup that I haven't seen on other podcasts. So uh, some of the other features with this, you can move this up and down the rail here and they're, they're also numbered right here 20 30 40 50 so you can have them exactly paired if you wanted to one of the uses I've seen other people use this for is when you're having uh, if this is a reporter and someone was giving a speech and you want to have one microphone for a different source or, or um, there's two different agencies, news agencies, that are trying to get someone the, the recording. So each one is for a different, completely different recorder and microphone. That's what this is for too. But for my use, um, a podcast, and when I want to go solo with it, the really amazing thing is that this is a removable. So when I remove it here, check this out. So I can stick this on a boom pole and it's just like if I were to have bought this by itself, I get two and then when I want to combine them for if I ever do that podcast setup I just mentioned, screw this back on, there you go. Pretty good value if you ask me. Now I'm going to put in, here's a Rode NTG3, then here's a Sennheiser. MKH416. They're similar diameters. I believe the smallest you can fit this in is a 19. Uh, let me just, how do, how do you put this on? I'm going to go in the back. So put this one on first, just squeeze it in. Yeah, right there. Lock it in. Turn it. There we go. And then I'm gonna put the NTG3 in, which has a similar diameter. It's not, I don't think it's 19, I think it's a little bigger. But squeeze that one in, 
point that one up. There you go. Check this out. The cables might get in a way. You might need some right angle cables, XLR cables, so they don't bump each other. But if you're interviewing somebody, uh, like in my podcast setup, the host, the guest, put this right in the center, you know, of a table, and then they don't have to go so close to the to each other. This absorbs all of the shock, all of the table noise. The Rycote's new system here that, that, that came out, I don't know, maybe a decade ago. This is a really good system. It's all plastic, so I suppose it could break if you drop it, but it's, it's lightweight. It's holding these two heavily used shotgun microphones that a lot of people use. If you can find this under $100 like I did, I would say this is a pretty good deal. Two for the price of one.